What's up, everybody? So this is a video on not a classic ATV, but it is a classic. And it's a 1922 Ford Model T. This is like a time capsule right here. Go back in time. It's 100 years old. 100 years old. And it looks better condition than most people's cars these days. Sorry if the camera looks all weird sometimes. My phone's not that good at recording. Check it out. Sick. This is where that like classic hot rod look comes from. With like that kind of hood. It's a Ford. Ford. It's got the hand crank on the front. Hand crank. It's super hard to crank over. <sighs> super hard. It's a one way crank. But it would be better if it had like a a wheel that you could spin and then just engage the clutch and then have it start like that but it doesn't work like that you had to be pretty damn strong to start these back then everybody nowadays has their fancy rims nobody really knows where they came from it all originated with these wooden Wooden wheels. Wooden wheels. This was high class back then. It's got the door that opens to the back. Instead of opening to the front. How cars nowadays do. Opens to the back. Classic, 100 years old. Nobody nowadays would even know how to use those pedals. You've got the ignition timing right here. No cars have their ignition timing on the steering wheel anymore. And then the, the gas is up here too. Horn, listen, listen to this classic horn. The battery is low. The battery is low. And then you got your window. My dad doesn't like when I touch these knobs. He thinks I'm going to break them. But you release these knobs and this pushes out. And there's your air conditioner. The doors are made out of wood. That's wood. It's got a steel, steel outer body, but it's got wooden doors, the frames, these old school chairs, old school seats, square glass all around, square glass all around. You can roll them down with these in the back, these little levers, the back glasses go down. So does the front. Right here, you got these. You roll down the glass. Also the back, right here. Only one that doesn't open is the rear glass. Even has a dome light. Old school steering wheel. There's the voltage, or there's the amp meter. There's the ignition switch. Well, this is just to let the truck either be on or off, but it doesn't control the starter. And then here's the lights. Lights is right here on this bottom, bottom switch. That's the starter. 
the starter is right here on some some newer year trucks like on the chevy blazers they had this kind of a switch but it was for the lights for the high and low beams wooden it's wooden a lot of things on this this truck was made out of wood but yeah i just thought you guys would want to see it because this is a classics channel technically if you think about it it was an atv because they'd be traveling on dirt roads with this. Probably not up any mountains. Maybe up some mountains, but nothing too rough. But yeah, piece of history. Classic. But yeah, thank you for watching. And we got a custom, custom Raptor 660 build coming up. We're doing a full engine rebuild and pretty much kind of like a restoration on it. So stay tuned for that. It's coming up soon. Got all the parts already. Later and God bless you.